Eminent Speaker is Chief Rene, who is from Saskatoon, Canada. He has been a chief of the Cumberland tribe for the last 12 years. His tribe is the oldest settled in West Canada. Chief Shabian is a good friend of the Jamaat, and it is a pleasure to have him at this Jalsa Salana. I invite him to come and say a few words. Assalam o alakam. Before I acknowledge the people that are here with me from Canada, I'd like to ask His Holiness for prayers for our people back home who are suffering with their daily battles with poverty and many other health issues, just like all of you around the world. So with that, I ask for prayers for us back home as well. So I want to acknowledge Chief Maigan from the Chippewa of the Thames. Also, Dr. and Professor Jeris Swidrovic. Councillor Dylan Baer, who is here with Brianna from the White Cap, Dakota Nation. Councillor Dustin Ross Fiddler from the Water and First Nation. And also my wife, who's a big supporter of mine and very, that's where I get my power and my strength from uh, Tanya Shaboyer. So with that, I, uh, I'll go into my statement and um, I'd like to thank uh, the community for this opportunity for us to be here. Uh, it's been very, uh, very uh, a big experience. You people are very humble and supportive. I can feel the love as I walk through and uh, interact with each and every one of you. It's a, a unique experience to uh, really be a part of, and I'm very honored to, to be part of it. So with that, this is a statement I would like to uh, respectfully pass to the Crown. First, we begin by thanking the Creator for bringing us all together. Back home, we always thank the, cre the Creator first and foremost with uh, the start of uh, meetings, gatherings, um, and at the end of our days. So by thanking the Creator for bringing us together, we want to acknowledge our ancestors who cleared the way for our people, we are standing here as present-day representatives, past, present, and future. As no settler can speak for us, the responsibility and the duty to honor the spirit and intent of treaty consistent to the laws of the Creator, truth befalls on the good minds and hearts of our ancestors. We remain proud of their leadership, their vision regarding our coexistence with the settler society. Kiskani Tamak, our elders, knew clearly even during their time that change was coming, just as it is in our time. We have waited a long time for Canada to respect and honor our treaty. Many times we have thought the delay was deliberate and tied to the federal and provincial government policies of neglect and extinguishment. We often think that the colonial strategy, which includes the totalitarian regime of the Indian Act and residential schools for a complete assimilation, was and remained the plan that we will forget our treaty and disappear. But we will not disappear, and we will not forget. With that, love for all, hatred for none. Thank you for in inviting us to Jalsa Salana Nanaskan Mitin. Thank you. Sir. Thank you.